You originally got a breast augmentation how long ago? It was 2012. I had a friend that was like, why would you even consider this? And the look on her face when she saw my breasts, she said, I would cut them off. Oh, really? Oh. Those look like beef jerky. Oh, okay. And that was like, that was no. not me. It by wasn't the way. her. Was she was not upset. <laughs> okay. No. So you thought about doing something about it? I did. It. Um, so I consulted with a few plastic surgeons in our area. Yeah. The one I chose did conscious sedation because I had this fear something would happen to me under anesthesia and my kids would have to have lost their mom in a tragic breast accident. <laughs> <laughs> I actually understand that because most people are not so much afraid of the surgery necessarily, they're afraid of the anesthesia, mm -hmm. right? Apparently they use ketamine. I remember knowing I was in my body, but not, and not being able to move, and nobody could hear me. It was horrific. Ketamine is a sometimes used anesthetic agent that allows a dissociation between your awareness of your body and the surgical procedure. A few weeks later, I noticed a start of a double bubble mm. under the right breast. Yeah. The breast tissue is completely separate from what I think is the muscle and the implant. A double bubble means you've lifted up too far below the muscle below the chest wall where the breast ends and the abdomen starts because you're trying to fill out as much of the breast envelope as possible. And to fix a double bubble, you have to stitch it back down. He also went into the left side again because he said he could tell where that was starting to do it also. Yeah, under conscious sedation again? Well, I said, I put that as an allergy on my chart. I do not ever want that again. Right. And he said, then I'll just numb you up with some lidocaine. And fix a double bubble? With lidocaine. Oh, okay. I remember smelling my flesh burning. Mm -hmm. I could see smoke. So what happened after this? They looked worse. The double bubble was still there on both sides. Correct. Okay. Yeah. And oh, I was not going to go back there. About a year later, I did consult with one other surgeon in our area who was supposed to be the best of the best in the state. Okay. So I was so hopeful, going into the office, and I take off my top. He said, sorry, there's really not much we can do with that.